Hi folks, Steve here at Boss Trailers. Today we're going to take a closer look at a 2022 Venture RV Sonic Model 220 VRB couples trailers. Uh, we already done the exterior video. I hope you watch that. Uh, this is only for the interior. So uh, let's talk a little bit about weight and length. This is 27 foot overall length. So that's about 20 to 23 and a half foot of box. Uh, weighs just a little over 4,700 pounds, extremely towable, seven and a half foot wide. We don't get to see that when we're inside. It's a great little trailer to tow. So a uh, couple of trailers, front, start with a Murphy bed. I know a lot of people don't like Murphy beds or they're not sure yet. Let's just start by saying that uh, it doesn't need to be a Murphy bed. If you want to leave the sofa down and your bed permanently out, you can. It will not affect uh, opening and closing the slide out it will not affect the traffic flow through the front door as well okay so but the day that you're stuck inside your trailer because the weather is horrible outside you can just put the bed up and you got a nice place to sit which uh, works very well with shorter people as well and you are sitting right in front of the TV which we're going to take a look at later now I'm going to demonstrate how long this takes to put down on your bed or up really all you need to do is to unfold your sofa, unlatch the back board, and here comes your bed. It is 60 inch wide, just like at home, 74 inch in length, the length of a double. You need more length? No problem. A lot of our customers just move that foam forward a little bit, and they get a an 8 inch or a 6 inch foam made for the where the pillows are going to be. And that's all it needs. Front windows, there is a blind there as well. Shirt closet on each side, pretty nice. Real hanging bar as well in there. And they actually cut the back of it, leaving you a little bit of a, a space there to leave your, your reading books, glasses, a glass of water, your alarm clock, your CPAC machine. There's a power outlet on one side and a USB outlet on the other. Now you want to, as you can see, it doesn't affect the entrance way, but you want to put it up. You can leave your pillows, you can leave your blanket, Nothing needs to be folded. All you need to do is to bifold the mattress and uh, put a ledge here, and there it goes. It literally takes five seconds. Now, lots of storage underneath your sofa. You do not lose that storage. One of the things that the Venture also added is a power outlet on each side of the bed. Why? Because if your bed is up, you don't have access to that power outlet. And if you're sitting on the sofa on your laptop and it needs to be charged, you got one on each side. There's also a window on each side that opens. And each window is in the trailer, except for the one in the kitchen, comes with a, a pleated shade. They also given you a privacy curtain. And there's a power outlet and a cable hookup if you choose to add another TV, which is not needed at all. TV is right there, right across from that, that little space. So, uh, dinette, really like it, huge bed, um, a couple things, uh, they added a couple years ago the doors at the front so you have access to the storage below and they left the front of the back bench open so you don't need to climb over, take the cushion out, open up the board to have access to what you put back there so it's a great spot, you can put a couple bins if you want. Um, a case of water, whatever it is that you bring with you while you're camping. Now the table will go down and turn that into a huge bed. Uh, Venture is giving you an extra cushion to put on top of the table because those back cushions are enclosed in uh, the back board which are not sliding all over the place. Really like that. A uh, nice little picture frame here. You can put your own personal pictures. This is just Velcro to the wall. Here we have our entertainment system. So a little TV actually comes out and it can swivel toward the dining room if you want. There's an AM, FM, CD, DVD, Bluetooth, USB, auxiliary, HDMI, uh, stereo. So it does take those $3.99 uh, movie bins from Walmart. A little bit of storage here. You can, use, you can use it as a pantry if you want, but there is a pantry right beside. So most likely that will be uh, stuff that you, uh, maybe the Tupperware. Uh, seven wrap rolls and stuff like that right here the pantry actually it's too big to be a pantry You'll probably be using a couple shelf only there's even more and more on top here and it goes all the way to the end against the wall kitchen well 
it's all here it's complete and it's very nice as well at the end the door opens and we have a button for your awning and your slide out some of the lights you have a USB outlet and a power outlet perfect spot to put your phone when you go camping uh, on a charge there's a door for a little bit of storage here It'd be a perfect spot to put some extra shoes and sandals right by the entrance door there's another one right beside maybe some of the pots and pans and then your drawers are plywood made ball bearing the whole drawer comes right out counter seamless so no water is going to damage the edge same goes with the table by the way there is a very deep farmer style stainless steel sink single bowl and they're giving you a little hitch cutting board that fits perfectly over the sink nice top window right by the kitchen plenty of light um rented outside range hood folks i mentioned it i mentioned it on the exterior video the reason why is there's a lot of trailers that do not vent the range hood outside so recirculating the air you got your microwave on the top you got the furion three burner stove bifold glass cover really like that cast iron grill very high end the oven itself is beautiful it's all glass now uh, very sturdy handle the button lit really like that and if the gas is on it turns to red there's even the light in the oven itself and it's all animal finish great great unit really like it uh, your fridge here it is a seven cubic foot gas electric so it's a traditional rv fridge uh, we're having a hard time getting those fridge now most of the manufacturer are preferred at uh, the 12 volt only fridge it gives you a little bit more depth because you don't need a chimney behind the fridge to vent out so and a lot less work for them as well because they don't need to put a side vent a roof vent run a gas line anyway this fridge is kind of nice if you're dry camping it doesn't consume a lot of power it basically cool on a little flame uh, from propane which is great and then when you plugged in uh, shore power on the campsite it just uh, automatically goes to power nice unit uh, thermostat right here this is for your furnace and your AC actually no light furnace only uh, a light switch for the interior lights in the bathroom we'll talk about that in a moment this little device right here is to help you level your trailer so it syncs to a free app that you download on your phone and when you back the trailer up uh, your phone will tell you when you're side to side level sometimes you know you back it up and then the ground goes wonky a little bit and in the one spot it's perfect well maybe that's where you need to unhitch and once that's done and you got it off the car or the truck uh, it'll tell you when you front to back level as well by using the electric tongue jack so it's a nice little helper it doesn't talk back and it doesn't yell at you all right bathroom a uh, nice nice room in this trailer for sure it's very large there is beautiful shower with glass insert liner and skylight i'm five foot eight i fit in it no problem there's probably another i'm gonna say eight inch above there so if you're six foot there's definitely not an issue a nice little corner vanity still looks stainless steel sink little cubby hole perfect i know the ladies will hide a couple of baskets in there and all the makeups and stuff medicine cabinet uh, your monitor panel for your water tanks as well as your water pump and your water heaters on there uh, GFI so if one of the outlets not working most likely this is at fault that's where you need to come and push the button a little bit of storage below the sink perfect for the extra paper towel rolls foot flush porcelain toilet self-closing lid as well so just like at home really like that and what people really enjoy or like is that extra hanging closet now behind here we have the outside kitchen as we've seen in the exterior video there's a little shelf so you can put some clothes on there and there's your extra cushions to uh, make out the bed on the dinette if you never bring anybody with you and you like to camping in a selfish way that's okay just leave the cushion at home there's also a power vent on the ceiling there's a motion detector lights when you come in into the bathroom F uh, folks it's uh, it's yeah nothing's missing this is a great little trailer just a little over 4700 pounds it's extremely towable i won't be here long folks I think we've done it. Thanks for watching.